big physical quarterback. Has been used in short yardage and goal line most of the year, but he's going to be running the offense at least to start this game. And on play one, it's a pitch to Quinton Lynch. It's a loss of three. Second and 13. Back to the line of scrimmage, maybe a true freshman at left tackle. Three true freshmen on this Georgia Tech offensive line. Now Jordan's showing that he wants to throw. He does, and it's caught by Stewart. That's Love the fullback dives in these situations, Clay. Jordan keeps it. First down for the quarterback. Matt Pale defense is trying to do today on first down. Boy, Marshall suffocated and then slammed down to the turf. Vinny Muff Bud Foster. This defense forces a second and ten. And it's going to be third and long as Jordan serving game one of a two-game team suspension for a violation of rules. On third and eight, sprinting out. Jordan being chased, hit as he throws, got rid of it to avoid. In uniform here at Lane Stadium, rooting on the Hokies, trying to wrap up a Coastal Division crown today. This is Matthew Jordan, the quarterback for Georgia Tech. Ball came out. Did he get it? The ACC play. Tremaine's brother, Terrell, the strong safety, is out for the first half because of targeting last week. That is a duck. Whew. Long day for this Georgia Tech offense. It'll be Jordan keeping him himself, and he's going to be close to the first down. It's going to be one now, Georgia Tech. 8.15 to go here, opening quarter. The toss to the A-back. This is Isaiah Willis. He'll spin ahead for a couple. Line taken on a Virginia Tech Hokie front. It's as good as you'll find in this league. Second and 12 now after the penalty. Jordan going to June. There's contact, and it draws a flag. Yeah, he has close to a third of the team's catches. They'll run it here on first down. It's Marcus Marshall. But still, right there is the B-back player. Expect him to have a good day here for Georgia Tech. They pitch it out this time. It's Willis. And he's got another Georgia. Watching the, the offensive line, the way they get off the football, getting some good push early on here in this game. Marshall again. Second. Second and four. Marshall, first down. Let's get an update on Pitt. He's going to keep it here on the ninth play of the series. Yep. First down, Georgia Tech. And quite a bit more as he gets inside the... First and 15 after the penalty. Jordan, hit, got away. And gets back close to the... See what Paul Johnson... Bounds up here in second and 11. He calls the plays, too. On the throw, Jordan bumped, and he falls down. That's good. There's a marginal throw. Jordan's going to keep it himself and get a handful. To join Randy Moss as the only players in NFL history to begin a career with six consecutive 1,000-yard seasons. This is Georgia Tech's Matthew Jordan. It's paid dividends here early on in this football game. Goes under center here on second and seven. They run it. It's the B-back Marcus Marshall. It'll bring a third and a half minutes of possession in that first quarter. Jordan drops back, now ready to run, and he is met by Tremaine. Bucky Hodges, McMillan were in the same space, the same area. There was bad spacing. The ball slightly overthrown and a big interception for Georgia Tech. Marcus Mark hands in the air. Certainly some confusion on that route. That's exactly what I saw, Kevin. That's, that's poor route running right there and not bad pass by the quarterback, Gerard Evans. Bobbled by Matthew Jordan after the situation. Georgia Tech two for six, converting on third down so far. Trying to get to the 30-yard line. The pass is underthrown, nearly picked off. Penalty flags on the play. Clearly a holding penalty. Marcus Marshall. Second. Okay. 
Marshall, first down, Georgia Tech. And he's had a far, hard time finding traction so far. What a good run for Marcus Marshall. His brother keeps the Hokie offense over on the sidelines. Second and three. First down, Matthew Jordan. He could go. Goodbye, touchdown. A 53 yard stack over first down and 10. This is their worst field position to start a drive so far. Matthew Jordan, their starting quarterback, has been terrific. Takes it to the outside. That's a first down carry. Give him 13. But Foster's defense I'd like to spark a big play because the offense has struggled today. Marcus Marshall. Keep it. Go out and run the option. He's picked up tough physical yards and a big home run for a touchdown. Gives it to his B-back, Marcus Marshall. Barrels it. And they're doing a great job winning the line of scrimmage here in this football game. The crowding 18 minutes time of possession. But that time, Jordan is going to be swallowed. Reason. Georgia Tech's giving them a little problem so far today. Sprinting out and deciding to keep it as the quarterback, Matthew. The line makes how low and how hard they get off the football. Trying to throw it. Nope. Take it off. Jordan needs eight yards, won't get it. There's Woody Barron again. This Clay trying to put Tack Moore on before halftime. Almost a field goal range already on the draw play. Jordan is dumped behind. Great motor and a great first step. Sixth tackle for loss for Virginia Tech. Pitch from Jordan to Clinton Lynch. He's got the first down, stays in bounds and gets it inside the 10. Who's got home run capability written all over him, Clay? He's a good receiver, and you can see a good runner, too. This is Marshall to the three yard line with Tech. Jordan keeps. Got it. Touchdown, Yellow Jackets. What a statement. And now he's uh, at the SEC now. Oh, there's a there fumble. Is. The Hokies have it. For the Hokie fans, he gets the Hokies back in this game. Matthew Jordan on that run. Communication issues now for Jordan. Got a yard, maybe. This music. Jordan escapes and muscles his stadium. It's 20 to 7, Georgia Tech. They've got the football back after the second interception thrown by Gerard Evans. Gerard Evans, Glenn. And Carroll, not very big. It was going to be hard to muscle through that and make the catch. Second and nine. Nice move. Matthew Jordan. Big down right here for this Hokie defense. Marcus Marshall, the B-back, lowers his shirt. Yeah. This Georgia Tech offense has looked pretty good without those star guys. No question. They have. And slipping there is Jordan. He got it to... Defense been on the field a lot here this evening. Barron, Woody Barron. Off the page yet when you're watching tape on this guy. Third and long has not been good to Georgia Tech. They need a dozen. Backpedaling. Duck. Almost intercepted. And he's been outstanding. 25 carries, 111 yards rushing. He's completed just one pass. And continue to... Just got to execute and make that catch. Boy, Marcus Marshall has been good. The game for the Yellow Jackets. An upper body injury is all we were told. That's what Justin Thomas is dealing with. He's suited up but hasn't played. And likely won't the way this is going. Just fine. He's under center now. Play fake. Looking to throw. Let's it go. 
Ricky June, the intended receiver, member out of retirement. An honor to Frank Beamer. Gives it to a special team star. You're right. Every week. Yeah. Jordan flips it into the secondary. It was an ugly pass, but June came back to the various Thomas Stephen Hill. They can put that ball up and go get. And they run it here, Kevin. And Georgia Tech already in field goal range for Butker. Fumbled, regained by Matthew George from Georgia Tech. Matthew Jordan. They're straight ahead. Last in the ACC in takeaways, and they've got four today. And they're going to grind it out on the ground with Marcus Marshall. Try and Taking that play clock all the way down. Marshall rips it off, and he could go. One man to beat, and he will do it. Touchdown, Georgia Tech. The win tonight. They're slow starting sometimes. That's right. The boy would say decide to get it going, and everything starts working itself out. They typically show they're one of the best teams in all the country. This Marshall, we've talked about being responsible, being disciplined. You take one step out of place, this offense can burn you. We saw that right there. Montua Palaka is going to make the tackle. The Hokies have one remaining. 8.05 to go. A third and two here for the Yellow Jackets. Oh! Jordan almost threw it away. Rolling to the sideline. And Virginia Tech recovers. Goes to that ground game for Georgia Tech. And the guy that's been the workhorse, Matthew Jordan. Second down and eight, four and a half to go. And Jordan will take that hit. Matthew Jordan. Defensive line. They'll take that play clock down as far as they can again and then pitch it out. A lot of room for Willis to run. Matua Palaka shoves him out well short of the first down. Down defense, next to last, and the Power Five Conference in sacks, and last in the A.